So we're in Fallon, Nevada. Uh, we drove all day yesterday. I think we were just exhausted when we pulled into the Walmart parking lot. Uh, thank God to Walmart. They're just the best place in the world for travelers. Uh, we don't live in Walmarts, but when we travel, we often look for a Walmart just as a safe place to stop along the way. And in some Walmarts, they allow you to do that. We always look for the sign to make sure we're okay. Anyway, uh, we slept in after such a harrowing day yesterday. Uh, that highway is, they call it the loneliest highway in the world. And they do for a reason. It is a rough, long route. Uh, but we're almost done. And we'll be to Reno, I'd say, within two hours. Uh, and moving on from there. So, stick with us. We're having a great time. Thanks. Bye. So, we blew Reno off because uh, the food deals weren't great. Uh, we got great food deals there before, but today's Sunday and they do all the brunches and we really wanted something more substantial. So I think we're going to run down to Lake Tahoe and see if we can find a better buffet there. Uh, and then we'll look for a place to uh, hang out. Uh, kind of surprising, Reno gasoline prices are just outrageous. And the only reason I'm paying these high prices here is because I'm sure by the time we get into California, prices are going to be even more. So the place to buy gas is Utah and believe it or not Colorado uh, but of course we're not there so we got to do the best we can so I'll keep you posted bye So we chose Harrah's in Lake Tahoe it was pretty good food but very expensive I thought for what you got uh, and you got a lot, but still it was expensive. I love staying at casinos because usually it's free <laughs> and you have pretty good food while you're there. Uh, last night though, we had kind of an odd situation. We had some very nosy neighbors and uh, it just felt uncomfortable. I think there are still a lot of people who don't understand what the van life is all about and why people do what, why we're doing what we're doing. Uh, and unfortunately, one of these people got a good look inside the van, and it was obvious that we weren't just traveling, that we were also staying. And so, for me, it's just a lesson about keeping a low profile on the road uh, and realizing that not everybody's going to get this kind of lifestyle. Well, we're heading it in early tonight. We had quite a day, and tomorrow is another exciting day. We should be in San Francisco by then. So, I'll keep posted. This is Tim Painter.